ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States. About my costume. When, Ab when Abraham Lincoln was president, he wore a black suit, coat, vest, and pants and shoes. He also wore a black dress shirt with a black bow tie. Sometimes he wore a black stove pipe hat. When he became president, he grew a beard. Let me tell you about one of the most famous presidents of the United States, Abraham Lincoln. He was born on February 12, 1809 in Log Cabin in Kentucky. He was a farmer and didn't hunt because he didn't like killing things. He told jokes and loved reading, even though he had only one year of schooling. Abe enjoyed life but suffered from depression. He also took part in town politics and became a lawyer in 1837. His political party was called the Whigs, and he supported the building of canals and railroads. Lincoln married Mary Todd on November 4, 1842, and they had four sons. In 1846, he was a representative from Illinois, then, represented, then, then rejoined the Republican Party. Because he was a good listener, people called him Father Abraham. Licking grew a beard because an 11-year-old girl said he would look more like a president if he had one. Sadly, on April 14, 1865, John Wilkes Booth, shot Lincoln at Ford's Theater. He died on the next day at the age of 56. Let me explain why Abraham Lincoln was so important. The Republican Party chose Lincoln to run for president, and in 1860, he became the 16th president of the United States. He always hated slavery, even though he was not an abolitionist. He made the phrase, a house divided against itself cannot stand famous. In his inauguration speech, Lincoln said he wouldn't let the nation become two countries. But on, the eight, but on April 12, 1861, the Civil War began anyways. He wrote the Emancipation Proclamation, which freed slaves on January 1, 1863. His most important speech ever was given was the Gettysburg Address. On November 18, 1865, Lincoln, Lincoln addressed the last, set aside the last Thursday of November to celebrate Thanksgiving. He was then re-elected in 1864 after the war ended in 1865. He encouraged Congress to pass the 13th Amendment to the Constitution, outlawing slavery. Because he was one of the most honored president, Lincoln appears on the penny and the five dollar bill. There is a moment there is a monument in the nation's capital called the Lincoln Memorial, and his face is carved on Mount, Mount Rushmore. Many things have been named after him and many books are about him. We will always remember Abraham Lincoln on President's Day in February. Thank you very much.